Imagine a world where we have to go to a new place, not knowing anyone, feeling afraid, alone, and out of place. A world you don't feel accepted or acknowledged. A world you live day by day, trying to cover up who you truly are in order to fit in. That was my world. That was me. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ariatha Dornazan. I am a junior at Atlantic High School, and I where I think you offers opportunity to share my story. <laughs> Robert M. Hensel once said, there is no greater disability in society than the ability to see a person as more. Over four million kids in the U.S. have at least one learned disability. I am a part of that statistic. Growing up, I struggled with a speech impediment known as stuttering. I often felt out of place and didn't want to share my learning disability. However, the Boys and Girls Club opened up my eyes and helped me realize that I have a purpose here and show that I belong here. This is how the Boys and Girls Club shaped my life. I owe it all to the Boys and Girls Club of Delray Beach for helping me become the person that I am today. The club has impacted me to become more orientated and helped me become a successful leader. At the Boys and Girls Club, there were two staff members who had the biggest influence in my life, Ms. Vanessa and Mr. Anthony. Ms. Vanessa was the one at the Boys and Girls Club who taught me to embrace my disability by showing me to turn the negative into a positive change. Mr. Anthony pushed me to come out of my comfort zone and step forward in helping me become a leader as he introduced me to the junior staff position. Through my experiences as junior staff of the Boys and Girls Club, I realized that mentoring youth is my passion. I built relationships with the younger members of the Boys and Girls Club and took the lessons that Ms. Vanessa and Mr. Anthony to teach them. Upon graduating high school, I planned to attend Florida State University, majoring in speech pathology. My ultimate goal is to become a speech pathologist, working with children in schools and giving them the next generation and platform to help them overcome the learning disabilities and gain the confidence that the Boys and Girls Club has given me. I'm beyond proud to say that the young girl who's afraid to speak out loud and share to others about my learning disability is now an honor roll student, a 4.0 GPA, is the captain. <laughs> the captain of her cheer team and has won several scholarships and awards. I say all of this to say while some see disabilities, I see possibilities. Possibilities for change, acceptance, and not anyone define you. Thank you.